Hey guys, Cam here, and I'm a detective. Almost professionally. Um, but until then, I have been investigating a variety of murders across the United States that I am convinced are the result of supernatural occurrences. Uh, but for my next case, I am bringing on special guest and very good co-host, very good friend, Max Walsh. <laughs> hey man, I'm really stoked to be here. I am really excited about your case. Me too. I'm going to be diving into a suspicious string of cold cases in my hometown of Glenwood, Iowa that still keep residents up at night. Get ready, ladies and gents, because this one gets pretty gruesome. Mm. Let me introduce you to the legend of the Sunny Family Cult. Between 1990 and 1993, 17 people in my hometown of Glenwood, Iowa mysteriously vanished. In addition to these disappearances, six people were found viciously murdered with this strange symbol found near the bodies. 18-year-old Adam Murphy was a known prankster, but on August 11th, 1991, his body was discovered. He'd been stabbed 28 times. This was the last video found in his VHS collection. I found this weird mask in my neighbor's trash, and this is what I like to call the mask mortar scare prank. Next to his mutilated body, police found a piece of paper with this symbol, which piqued the interest of local reporter, 26-year-old Mary Dixon. A prank gone wrong, a senseless death, and a mysterious symbol. Could the death of local teen Adam Murphy be linked to the rumored Sunny family cult? But on September 7th, Mary Dixon was found in her car with her face and body viciously slashed. She was beyond recognition. The same mysterious symbol was found in the car. There's clearly a link between the seemingly ritualistic murders of Adam Murphy and Mary Dixon. I agree, but despite all the evidence, the investigation was strangely dropped at the insistence of the local district attorney at the time. Perhaps there's somebody working within the police force to conceal these reprehensible endeavors. Yeah, no, that makes yes. sense. I, I just don't understand why Mary Dixon. Maybe she got too close to the case and was murdered for spreading the truth? Right. She didn't believe the Sunny Family Cult was behind these deaths. But we still don't know whether the Sunny Family Cult is actually real or not. And if there is a group of people running around killing people in Iowa, then uh, what is their motive? I don't know, man. That's the question. I think the symbol might be the work of some monster who kills to appease a deity, or a ghost who uses the power of the symbol to recover damned souls, or, 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 or another witch who inscribes the symbol as a means to bring the dead back to life stronger than they ever were before. Yeah, maybe, but we should probably think about it a little more. Yes. Um, we will continue our investigation into the Sunny Family Cult. Um, <clears throat> but until then, uh, keep your eyes out, your heads down, and your ears open. Later. I want to fix this toxic world. I want to show people the lies that have made up their reality. Start over together. We're going to make it something new. Taylor, go! Something better. Watch new scary vids every Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday.